Content over by everything! The guy, this guy's called Ali Dawa, it's his, uh, what, he's one of the uh, sort of organizers. As they call it like Salam, uh, which means like hello and happiness. Um, and it's just like evangelical, uh, telling people that Islam is true. Um, he, yeah, well, I have a particular question for them, which is like, basically, why are they so certain that Islam is true that they're, you know, willing to implement a legal system that has its laws? Zero. Zero. Zero Zero goodness to humanity. But Jesus Christ said to the Pharisee and Sadducee and said, yeah, he that. Who's among you? Well, it's kind of silly, but yeah, we'll, like, we'll maybe get into that if, like, uh, depending on if they let me kind of, like, present the challenge to them or not. All of them, they said, we are one of the way, but Jesus Christ said, I sorry, am sorry, the sorry, way. I am the one. I am the truth. I am the, I am the life. No more in the past. No more in the present. No more in the future. We'll see God except through such agonizing death of Jesus Christ on the cross. My sister, mama, this is not a symbol of faith. Well, I know you don't like it, I know. Well, then you can move, my friend, you can move. You, you can move that as you can move. Jesus Christ said, Anna al has Anna al-Khalifa, Anna al-Khalifa. He said, I am the way, I am the truth, I am the light. Sirat al-Mustaqim, Lord Sifon Muhammad came. Jesus Christ claimed it in the world. Do you know what? I'm here to say something. Yes, yes. Hello there. How are you doing? I'm doing okay, thank you. How are you? Is my going to pick this up? Are you? Yeah. Is it loud? Is it loud? Can you hear us? Can you hear us? Oh, the loud. My Muslim friend, they said, Islam could be right because many will follow. But Jesus Christ said, that's the way of destruction. Islam is the way of destruction. Islam is the way of destruction. Why do I say that? I am ex-Muslim. I am on fire for Jesus. He set me free. From what? I am what I'm talking about. He set me free. There are children around us. He set me free of the internet. So, uh, uh, Siri apparently asked if uh, I could speak to you. Uh, you said you wanted to speak to me. Yeah, yeah, like, or it, it came as a challenge for other pe Muslim creatures in the park in particular. It's basically, um, yeah, yeah. Is, is it ready uh, now? Is it really loud? Muhammad in the Quran said, I do not know what will happen to me when I die. Are you greater than Muhammad? Okay, sure. Yeah, okay. Yeah, yeah, sorry. It's like, how, I mean, the, the topic is, uh, you know, how certain, well, what's your evidence for being certain that Islam is true, especially if you're kind of uh, sort of certain enough that you're willing, that, that you'd believe in your ideal Islamic state to include, for example, the apostasy law and that kind of thing. So what I'm saying is like, um, if there are some people who kind of believe that in the ideal Islamic state in the future, there should be a punishment for people who leave Islam. And so kind of, what's their evidence for Islam being true? Because they must be really certain if they're willing to kind of uh, kill people who leave Islam. Okay, so okay, I thought it was more about uh, if Islam becomes... Are you saying to me? Are you saying, if you say Islam, that you don't want Islam to be the dominant... Uh, well, I mean, well, uh, like Leon must have misrepresented me, but like we can talk about that as well. Or, like, do I'm half an hour each, or I would prefer to stick to one topic, like the topic of apostasy. I think you discussed it with Hijab already. But it's, it's that's only like a sort of a premise. It's like I could say it's about any other sort of Islamic law. It's like basically, what is the you know good evidence for believing that Islam is true? Yeah. Okay. We can do that if you want. If you really want to discuss. Yeah. yeah. But uh, yeah, I'm sorry if you kind of like, I know, uh, agreed no, no, thinking about something fine. else, it's like fine. I'm... It's fine. Uh, give me one second. So if you want, you start, and then from there, you can take... 
Você é que Ok. Um, Alright, assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Oh, Ustad! Oh. I wasn't told. <laughs> he, he's just a little bit salty about being a Faisal supporter. Ustad! Come here for a second. What's the reason? Come, come. So uh, basically uh, Adnan Rashid's telling Ali Dawa not to speak to me and that sort of thing. He's uh, called uh, Ali Dawa off camera. I don't know exactly what they're talking about. No, no, I'm not going to give them an excuse um, because I want to have this discussion. I, I think there's a productive discussion to be had here, so I don't want to jeopardize it. Yes? Because you've had many discussions on the same topic and we haven't reached a any kind of conclusion, I was talking for the sake of it. So I'm being told not to have a pointless discussion because you've talked about this matter before. It's been discussed a variety of times. What is the purpose? So if I come to you here, imagine I go to, imagine you have a belief system and I come to you and say, oh, I want to talk about this. And then I go to another person and I keep talking and this pointless discussion just continues to carry on. So I'm being told not to waste your time or my time by discussing the same thing that's been discussed before. And I, I think that's reasonable because what are we achieving? Are we talking for the sake of it? Are we here for the for a purpose, what's the reason? So you get it. So that's why I don't okay. like. I don't want to be here like having conflict in Saudi I don't want to have like conflicting discussions here, or just we're just here to convey the message. You get it. So you've talked okay. about this discussion before, man. There's nothing else no. I'm going to add into it. I, I like yeah. so the discussion. Well, I think this is the kind of thing that lots of people, both Muslim and non-Muslim, would have. Uh, you know, worries about like. Well, we've discussed this. You've discussed this before many times. What, like, what? Hijab, with a lot of people, it's been no, discussed. No, we haven't. You have, you have. Not really. Yes, you have. No, <laughs> you no, have. You've no, discussed but, this with many people. There's, no, what, what is it? Are we talking for the sake of it? What's, what's, the, what's the reason? I don't think it will be talking for the sake of it. I haven't heard. I haven't heard from you what you think is, you know, well, the evidence the is, of though, Islam what, being what, true. What, what Hijab is going to say, what he said, what Ustad al she said. There's nothing else I'm going to bring different. Do you get it? It's, it's the same thing. So I think the discussion is pointless. I, I genuinely believe it. I, did, I mean, are it's you... It's going to be pointless because I genuinely want to speak what, to people. What, 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 would, um, what would convince you otherwise? Convince you otherwise what? Yeah, what, what, would, what, would, what are you looking for in a discussion <coughs> in order no, for it to be no, fruitful? I believe, for example, that you're, you've discussed this matter with different people, yeah? Like who? So, so there's, there's nothing... There's nothing new. It would write to people. Come on, man. You've discussed this and very other things. So what's the point? I, I haven't. Of I haven't been in the park for about six months, and yes, I've like looked. Nothing... I've looked into Islam in more depth since then, yes. and so I. I'm actually, you know, behind on this topic. I don't know. I don't know what you think is the good evidence that Islam is true. Like, like, look, I, I don't know what you're thinking. Well, there is a variety of evidences, but like said, oh, no. it's already been discussed. It's, it's been discussed and. I, I, don't, I don't want to waste your time, I'll be honest okay, with you. It, it, it seems more like you're kind of blacklisting me because... And you know that Adnan Rashid is angry maybe, with maybe me because I brought evidence that, that, that you, this that and this, this and that. Well. well, it's not false allegations, but yeah, okay. you know that that's kind so, of... So, 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 we, so we can't we can't consider him to be... That. He's not an unbiased person, is he? Okay, but prior to other people have told me as well, it's not just Ustad Adnan, prior to people said, look, what's the point? And, I, and to be honest, I don't want to talk for the same. Okay, that, that's a real shame, that's a real shame. I'm sorry. Okay, all right. Well, I'll, like, I mean, if, if, if you don't want to talk to me, then I'll have to just talk to uh, kind of COE. Basically, what I was going to ask Ali Dawa is, um, 
you know, what's his evidence for being so certain that Islam is true? Because he must be certain that Islam is true if he believes that we should implement Islam's laws in the ideal Islamic state in the future. And if those laws say that kind of, um, you know, a Muslim who leaves Islam should receive the death penalty, uh, you must be certain, you must have certain evidence that this is the right thing to do. Because otherwise, you'd be risking killing an innocent person for no good reason. So people who believe in conventional Islamic law, they have a very high burden of proof that they've set up for themselves. So I, w I would like to know what Ali Dawa or Adnan Rashid or um, Mansur or any of these other people who believe that Islam is true and that we should implement Islamic law in the ideal Islamic state in the future, what is their evidence for believing that Islam is true? Because otherwise, they would just be kind of risking killing people for no good reason other than just their personal faith or, oh, I personally think it's true, it just feels true to me. But that would be insane. So that's what I wanted to ask him. It's a shame that uh, he's declined and he's kind of walked away now, I guess, because it's bad optics. I'll let him get back to his stand. I'm not going to hold him hostage for much longer. But I expect that this is going to be the kind of response from a lot of them. I've been kind of soft blacklisted as a speaker by lots of Muslim Dawa speakers, basically because I kind of know a few things about Islam. And so a lot of the typical kind of uh, dodgy claims aren't going to pass by me as easily as they'll pass by someone who knows nothing about Islam. So uh, it's unfortunate. I hope that there will be maybe some other Muslims who are brave and sure enough in their faith to discuss this topic with me, especially if there are any Muslims who believe that uh, Islamic law, such as the apostasy law, you know, the death penalty for the apostasy, uh, such for other laws like, um, I know, offensive jihad, for example, such as, um, I know, a key sas being different between Muslims and non-Muslims, uh, as in a, you know, retaliatory punishment, uh, eye for an eye being different between Muslims and non-Muslims. I hope there'll be, uh, you know, some Muslims who are willing to discuss what they think is their kind of good evidence for Islam being true. Anyway, uh, maybe talk... Why don't you talk about stuff that you agree on? Why uh, that you agree on? I mean, you we, 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 we can talk... I mean, if Ali Dawa... Ali Dawa apparently... So, like, the, the, what, what, the way that this came to be set up is because kind of a... Uh, um, someone asked Ali Dawa, oh, uh, James wants to debate you. And somehow there was a miscommunication there where Ali Dawa thought that I wanted to talk about uh, Islam's effect on society or something like that. And I'm happy still to have that discussion with uh, Ali Dawa if he wants. So I don't want it to, I mean, I asked if he was happy with this one as well. I wasn't responsible for like, sure. miss... You know uh, that would have been a much more interesting conversation than Google by Islam. Oh, well, I, it's a central conversation. It's a, it's a, it's a good question to ask. Yeah. I, I would have loved to see the implementation and the effect of Islam on society. Yeah, same, 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 same here. So, I know, I mean. So, so I'm not going to be. I'm not going to be one that I'm going to be. No, I, I wanted to do the, the challenge that I kind of uh, made that video. I wanted to present that challenge to people. Um, but uh, I'll, I'll, I'll leave now so that Ali Dawa can get back to his stand. Um, but maybe. Uh, maybe maybe we can ask him okay. later and say, oh, okay. Anyway, this is James only for one Hello. minute, and Ali Dawa is no longer here. Uh, yeah, he he uh, basically Adnan Rashid came and said, um, oh, don't talk to this man. He is an Islamophobe. He is a hate preacher. Oh, because you proved oh, that Adnan was uh, linked with some terrorists. <laughs> yes, yes, exactly. Well, <laughs> he was in his past. He's not anymore. Um, he was in his past. Well, you don't know. Maybe he's just hiding no, no, it better. Uh, he, he's 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 uh, Iqbal al Muslimin now. He's not a, a terrorist. Um, but uh, anyway, um, I mean, let, I'm gonna head here and give you back uh, this. But uh, yeah, maybe, maybe. from Malcolm Ali. Man, say it straight. Man, don't listen to BBC. Man, don't listen to ITV. But in that moment, he just said, He's a fully God. He's fully man. Fully man. man. And fully man. So he just said that Jesus got tired, Jesus got hungry. When he was on the cross, when he was being beaten and tortured and whipped, then he felt that pain. So he felt it as a, as a human being. That's what I'm saying. It's just, is, is this just what you've been told, or is this what you know for a fact? This is what the Word of God tells us. No, no, but, but can the Word of God tell, tell me? What do you mean the Word of God? Do you mean the, the Bible tells us? The Bible. Yeah. So do we have any evidence that the Bible's correct?